If you're a Christian or somebody who's thinking seriously about Jesus of Nazareth, you, you've probably been discipled by somebody, but that word is kind of like, what does that even mean, to be discipled? Well, a disciple is a learner, is a, somebody who's sitting at the feet of a teacher and becomes his or her disciple. And when Jesus formed disciples, these were folks who sat at his feet and listened to his parables, listened to his sermons, scratched their heads a lot of time. He had to help them figure out what he was saying. They are people who want to be Jesus followers and want to be want Jesus as their teacher. When we disciple, when someone disciples us, especially as a Christian, they're discipling us and teaching us what Jesus taught his disciples. We are in a long tradition of Jesus followers who want to know what Jesus had to say on any number of topics. How do you disciple somebody? It's when you share the words of the master. I, I'm not discipling people with, with my wisdom. That would be pretty, pretty limited. Instead, I'm discipling people with the wisdom of Jesus. And this is something we do actively because we're called, believe it or not, we're not called just to preach the gospel. We're called to make disciples. That's a very different process, right? That's, that's about a, not a single proclamation. I'm just going to say this one thing and then I'm done. No, actually teaching takes time. It takes relationship. It takes continuous effort. And if you are going to disciple somebody else or be discipled by somebody else, we have to make a commitment. So, look, we're already doing this, right? I mean, if you're watching this, you already have something that you're really a fan of and you could tell me all about it. Maybe it's a sport team that you follow. You follow some team and you already know everything there is to know about that team. Maybe it's some show you're watching on streaming platforms and you know everything there is to know about that show. You could teach me a lot about that. Why? Because you're constantly allowing somebody else to teach you about it. Well, my question is, why do we think that stuff's so important? I mean, we're, we're, we're Jesus followers, right? First and foremost, are we spending as much time learning about Jesus as we are learning about our favorite sports teams or our favorite shows on, on, on streaming platforms? I mean, think about that. I, I'm just as guilty as anybody else, don't get me wrong. What I listen to, what I'm willing to listen to, to be discipled is a choice I have to make. It's a choice you have to make. Are you willing to be discipled so that you can disciple somebody else?